After months of going without one, people in Montpelier want their post office back, and they're calling on the government to step in and help. They had the state's congressional delegation with them this afternoon to make their case for their services to return. NBC5 Sid Boulay was there. She joins us now live from Montpelier with more on this. Hi, Sid. Brian Liz, right now Vermont is the only state where its capital city doesn't have a post office. It's been like this for 182 days. We need a post office! A rally for Montpelier's post office bringing together residents and Vermont congressional delegation, demanding help from the U.S. Postal Service. For believing that the capital of the great state of Vermont deserves what 49 other state capitals have, a functioning post office. 182 days. That's how long Montpelier has been without a post office. The city's post office closed after July's flooding, leaving postal workers to operate out of trucks. They were working under these canopies that didn't work and they had to use their iPhone flashlight to try to read the mail. Uh, there was no heat and it was cold. It's unbelievable. Those trucks closed in November. Since then, residents have been left to figure it out on their own, with no reopening plan for the building. The post office, which is supposed to serve the people, is not here serving the people of Montpelier. We're the capital city. We deserve better service than this. The delegation reached out to Postmaster to join in November and still haven't gotten a response. It's outrageous! We're mad as hell! We're not going to take it anymore! Community members forced to travel to other towns to send and receive mail, which often isn't practical for residents or helpful for the downtown community. It is a hardship for seniors. It's a hardship for small businesses. It's a hardship for regular people who are just wanting to be part of their community. And part of a vibrant community is having a post office. Vermont's congressional delegation is asking you to continue to file complaints with the Postal Service, hoping that it will push the government to help reopen the building here soon with the post office. Live in Montpelier, Sid Buley, NBC5 News.